It looks like this vehicle's been involved in something pretty nasty. Go to the crime scene, pick it up, and bring it into the warehouse. Oh, that's right. Hold on, my my Karuma got blown up, and I forgot to dial that in. Luckily, it wasn't blown up by me, so should be a freebie. Hello, this is Morse Mutual Insurance. I think we can do that. All right, let's take the uh, the Duco death anyway. The baby elephant. Whoa, wait, what the heck happened there? Kind of revved up without me. What's going on here? At any rate, this is your Black Knight, see you in pajamas. Again, just trying to get a feel for what the new free mode is like. And an interesting thing is that it seems like, at least at times, uh, people are actually busy doing missions and therefore, there's less griefing going on. Well, having said that... How are things? That car's a... Ooh. Well, now this will just be kind of great, won't it? Now, kids, this is not something I recommend you do at home. Back it up, back it up, back it up. The only way you're getting the car. Again, this is a, a simulation of not really reality. The, this is gonna be. Uh, this is gonna be Stars City, you know? Nothing says we have to get the car with stars on it. Let's lose... Wow. Lose the stars. Here we go. Lose the stars. Lose... Okay, we gotta keep losing stars here. Go for a drive. Completely away from the crime scene. Because I am a criminal. Again, this is a criminal simulation. I would never ever recommend doing any of these kind of actions in real life. I have complete respect for the man in blue. Keep me safe on a daily basis. Believe me, you me. But I've oh, lost the stars. We are playing Grand Theft Auto, where my character is not, in any way, shape, or form, a non-psychotic crazy person. You know what a BB gun Me, I'll edit that out. <laughs> okay. Okay, we've returned after some unpleasantness that really we don't need to get into. Yeah, it's all kinds of dead people here. Dead person in the vat. Get out of the car. Are you a dead person? And now we'll just wheel this one around the corner. And again, this is the real test. Will people kind of let me be? Hey, Just to bring this vet back here? Yeah. Will something explosive come flying in from overhead? You look like a trip. There is someone along my path. Here. It could be an optical delusion. Yeah, it's an optical delusion. He's just in that one. Nothing like an optical delusion. Carefully zip our way around here. So 
far. Oh, looking good, looking good. What if this is a cult part of a collection? I bet you it is. Seems like a collectible. I'm seeing a lot of dots around my dot. Matter of fact, that's bad enough. Oh yeah. This is, there's an entire crew down there. No, you fucking idiot. Listen up. The Lancey fucking may do it. Okay, let's do this. What we gotta do is cut down a street here or two. Hola, mi amor. How are you? Yo, you get down hey, you cool? No, oh, that's the river. Whoa. Here we go. We can cut down here. Change up the path altogether. I have no idea what was happening there. At some point we gotta make the run for it. But at least we want to go past them. snuck one past there. I think there was some, some sneakery going on. And I don't think we're going to sell one right now. It doesn't look not with people hovering. Possibly with, you know, rocket launchers or something. Okay, that's on the books at your warehouse. You've got to use the SecuroServe terminal at the office if you want to go after another one. Yeah, I kind of get the drill by now. No, Agent 14, I don't have, like, the $4 million you really need to get a, uh, a mock mobile operations center. You really could, I mean, you really need to get the vehicle, the, the weapon and, and vehicle upgrades to make it worthwhile. I can't believe you're still a cooldown on that. Now, is that a collectible? Yes, it was. It was one of the collectibles. I had a feeling. So we need to, we would need... To get another collection to go. You can get another car anyway. How you doing? This does look nice. I love the way the light falls on that Z type. That's not a fact. We need to get a picture there. Is it bad? Too pretty, too pretty. Now, one of the tricks here is if we've got people who are kind of hovering around outside. I say we go out with things as even up as possible. We're not selling something right off the bat, and we're not. Let's at least go out into the world where we have some confidence with our ride here. I haven't driven the, the Ruiner 2000, have you? you the Ookmobile, as it might be called. In quite some time. I'm actually starting to get mixed up which one's the Ookmobile and which one's the, the Uka Death. Well, the Uka Death is probably the other one. Now, let's see. But here's an interesting question. Can you put this in the bunker? Is it considered a personal vehicle? There's one option on the if you get the you can get the uh, the MOC with a personal vehicle storage bay and then just a weapons modification. It would be cheaper probably initially if you're planning on using something like this kind.
I'm not seeing anybody. I source another one. All this is going on my bunker is building stuff up. I'm really kind of curious about if this car will be able to be allowed in the bunker. And if we park it there, will it stay there? Maybe that's more important. You can always come back and do a source another car. I don't intend to knock anybody's stuff up. I'm not in griefer mode just yet. I'm not, I'm not in police enforcement mode. This is another, this is a great thing. If you want to role play with law enforcement, you say, well, gee, it's too bad because we can't have police cars. Oh, no! mm -hmm. This is the deal. This is the one to get. Of course, you're probably going to either go off to a heavy shark card to get it or do a lot of illegal things. So, or race a lot. You can do a lot of racing. Yeah, this is one of the reasons I picked is this bunker, of course, which gets relatively close. I shouldn't take two. Yeah, oh, that was just great. Got over one car and... Should've hit the chute. It's been so long since I've driven this car, I could kind of remember exactly. There we go. In space mode. Okay. Hard to believe I don't drive this like every day. Because it's cool. Uh, I think it's going to be an interesting thing to work out. Which is going to be more cool? This or the oppressor? The oppressor has rocket engines. And it can glide forever. This has the turbo jump and can glide forever. The bike has either machine guns or missiles. This has machine guns and missiles. But if you have... If you have missiles on the bike, it has more of them. And that's all it's got. And of course, either one is taken out pretty much instantly by a missile. Somebody's in their bunker, but we're going to go to our person. You cannot enter the bunker with this vehicle. Now, if you can't enter the bunker with this vehicle, that means it's not a personal vehicle. And that means it's not a special vehicle. As far as the bunker is concerned, it's not one of the bunker special vehicles. That means that we, we have here is one of the greatest travesties ever perpetrated upon GTA. You have the Knight Rider tractor trailer that you drive cars into, and you have the Knight Rider, and you cannot drive the right nighter, the, the right nighter, the Knight Rider into the Knight Rider truck. It won't go in the bunker, not going in the truck. Man. Rockstar, come on, you gotta get you gotta work that out. Now we just have to head back to the office, which we can't park it in there either. We can park it out front while we go and get another mission and go out and grab it and use this on the mission. I feel like a little lunar 2000 mission here. Excuse me, coming in. That's one way to get through that. That intersection. The people in this town are so rude. I wonder if the people in a LA really do like curse the people. Like I've never been. I've never been to LA. Where are we out? Furthest west I've ever been is uh, Prim, actually. Prim, Nevada. I don't know if people drive around like this either. Let's just park it properly. 
Will it be there when I get back? That's an interesting question. Kind of an interesting question. You don't see it there now. It'll be interesting if the car goes away the instant you walk into a building. That would be limiting. There's the boss. Bet she gets a little source to this car and Hopefully it's not like a mission they'll need the Shotaro for. Because, I mean, the, the Runer 2000 isn't the fastest. If this, this is one of those races, then I'll have to go grab the Shotaro. I could try racing it with the... Come on. Top range caramel. The caramel I know is one I can just sell. going to have a good week boss oh I'm hoping let's uh, exit to ground now this could be actually rather hot it is still there. That's a good test. So, thanks to stupid thieves and social media, Sekiro served Trace this stolen car to a race meet. Get over there, steal it again, and bring it to the warehouse. Okay, that's an easy one. Relatively speaking. Assuming I don't wreck the car to begin with. Just giving it some style points here, giving it a, a fresh look. Oh, so Not yet, you're talking. So then someone said driven this. It is a muscle car, it's basically just a ruiner. With a whole bunch of doodads. So we're probably going to leave this there, so this will be the last ride for today. Again, it's remarkable. I hate to jinx, jinx myself here, or jinx myself, or jinx myself. Oh, no, this is a different one than I thought. This is a different one. We would have been better off. Now, we really have to switch to machine guns here. the vehicle we needed to get. Oh, there was a, there was a danger. There. It looked, I was aiming in the other direction. That also looks like a fox body mustache. Can't get them all, can you, boss? Come back and log on to secure serve if you want to go for another car. Now we have to escape and... No. We could lose. Oh, give me some blinking here. Oh, this is good. Yeah, we can't bring it in there either, but I can go in there. Woo! Just walking along, singing a song. Okay, let's just wait. 
Yeah, the Ruiner isn't the best for these that particular mission. What I really needed there was the Karuma. You just pick everybody off. It's not a hard mission, but I really didn't have the vehicle for what I needed there. All right, we're good. Back to the office. That's too. That's too bad too, because you know that would have been a cash cow. The ruler is looking a little spent. You Why is it so entertaining when the game swears at you? It's just hilarious. That thing's smoking. I'm gonna park it. Shot half to bits. Even with its kind of magical abilities. Wow. That, none of that worked out. The boost. It's tough to see them in the roof. Yeah, hey, we'll park it outside the other apartment. Especially since if they blow it up, I'll just get another one. I don't know if it goes back if I pull another car. Enter my office. Let's enter the office. Yeah, the only that I failed on that one. That was my bad. But you know, I think it killed otherwise. I just good to see you, boss. The missile hooked the wrong way. Took I wanted the left bank of cars blown up and not the right bank of cars. Yeah. What are you gonna do when you're the CEO in pajamas? Yeah, she's she's not a wonderful person. No, it's top range Osiris Pharaoh. Okay, let's see what this room involves. And that's how you're going to get it done. End of discussion. That's really disappointing, though. The one thing I really wanted to do was drive the Ruiner 2000 into the back of that and then modify it. Maybe in a future update. Who knows? Those details on the vehicle should be with you. Get it and bring it in for storage. All repairs are charged to the company. Okay, so that means it's just a drive out, get it, and then something happens. Either it's a bomb car, or it's just a drive it home thing, or people come and get you. We'll take the Duke Odep, because it can take missiles if need be. How far out are we going? Out in the middle of nowhere. It's a long trip. I think this is just a long trip kind of thing. Do go to ask, excuse me. See how I just push you right around. It's a do go to kind of thing. It's a do go death kind of thing. Driving through the traffic straight through it. It's a do go dead kind of thing. Somebody's zipping along in a presser. And there's a helicopter in the air. This may be more typical of what I expected. 
maybe be on their own missions. You don't know. I hope. Oh, well, there you go. Oh, look at that. That actually kind of worked for me. We got an oppressor inbound. Let's tie him up. Change a little momentum. It's a Duco death armor kind of thing. Now I'm supposed to be going that way? Come on, I just said I had to turn it out. Here we go. Now this is all fine and dandy while I'm in the Duco death, which can take like eight missiles. And that guy only has a machine gun, so you know. up into the hills. Okay, because this could get weird. Alright, now let's see what happens. We can get up here. We're going to bring Osiris down this? This isn't going to be We lose the oppressor, or you know, like a win 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 there, or not win win there. We're gonna win for this. Or is he just gonna wait till I'm not in a duplo death? I expected more from the oppressor. I think he was upgraded with the missiles. Well, they're flying so fast and they have so much momentum. He might have just died on impact when he, when he landed. There's the car. Why don't we just park this Duke of Death here where it says no parking? Because obviously that's not the biggest part of my day. Excuse me, I have to jack this car, which is probably a bomb car. I'm going to be willing to bet. Yep, it's a bomb car. Oh, you're kidding me! I'm gonna die. We're, we're down in the mud. Like, we're literally so screwed here. It's not funny. Tell me it was a bomb car. If I hadn't, if I hadn't fallen down the hill, I probably would have been okay. And eh, that's two fails in a row, folks. I'm actually not that far from my other car. Yeah, I am. It's all the way over there. Can't get them all, can you, boss? You, you come got back me. and log on to Secure Serve if you want to go for another car. You got me blown up. <sighs> so on that note, I think we've done enough for today. Um. Hope you've enjoyed it. Hope it's been kind of a, a relaxed sort of CEO in pajamas. Typical kind of thing. And uh, on this note, uh, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night.